Good morning. How are you all doing? I hope you are all well. I'm just going to move the phone down a bit because you can't see my feet. So if you've got mats, please bring that along with you as well. So ensure you've got water as well. If you're in the house, windows are open. If you're outside, lucky you. I think that's about it. Only do this workout if you're feeling fit and well. We'll start off with warm up and then we'll just do higher options. There will be lower ones as well, so this is suitable for people with all abilities. First 20 minutes or so is aerobics, then after that we're doing some toner up. So if you've got hand weights, grab them. If you don't, that's okay, you don't need them. If you've got a mat, grab that, have it ready, but we don't need it right now. Can you all hear me? Okay, if you can, just thumbs up. I'm just going to quickly start the music and we'll get going. Okay, brilliant. Hi. You will be absolutely fine. There's going to be high options, low options. I've actually not taught in about a month, so um, this routine will be brand new to everybody. Hi Chris, hope your knee will get better soon, so just take it easy and you take this one out. Um, are you all ready? So give it a march. Shoulders back, chest up, abdominals, squeeze and march the legs. So if you've got the dog or the cat near you, please move them out of the way. First move is heel dice, heel to down, toes to sky. Three, two, one, let's go. Arm curls. Four more. And three. Two, then back to the march. March it. Shoulders back, chest up, abdominal squeezed in. Next move that we're going to do, we're going to march out, then in, in three, two, one, let's go. Out, out, in, in, out, out, in, in. This looks weird, it feels a bit strange too. Two more, last one, back to the march. So if you have space, we're going to walk forwards, then we're going back for four. So I'm going to step a bit further back, otherwise I'll be right up there in four, three, two, let's go, four, three, two, one, and back. Last time, back to the march. Next move, we're going to side tap and reach across. Squeeze in that abdominals, arms should be shoulder height. In four, three, two, let's go. Tap and reach. We're gonna keep on doing that. Keep on going. Tap and reach. Last two, march it. Next move is leg curls. We're going to bend our knees, kick our bums. We're going to pull back the arms. In four, three, two, let's go. Kick, kick, kick. Woo! Push out the chest. Pull back those arms. Next move is doubles, double leg curls. One, two, one, two, one, two. Last time on each leg. March it. Next move, back to the heel devs. We're going to cross, cross, and curl the arms. Are you ready? And four, Three, two, heel to X. Cross and curl. Heel to ground, toes to sky. After this, forwards and back. In four, three, 
two, come forward. Four, three, two, one, and back. Back to march out, march in. Out, out, in, in. Out, out, in, in. Next move is going to be the box step. Or you might notice a B step. Two more. Last one, B step. Out, out, in, in. Bend the knees. Shoulders, back chest up. March those arms. Keep on going. Four more. Four. After this, side tap and reach across. Two. Last one, tap and reach. Squeeze in those abdominals. Shoulders back, chest up. We're going to reach up high. Touch the step. Woo! Bend those knees. Lower option. Stick with this one. Tap and reach. Woo! Two more. Leg curls, singles. Woo! Pull back those arms, push out the chest. Are you ready for doubles? I can't hear you. Two more. Into doubles, let's go. One, two, one, two, one, two. Woo! Next move, single punches. Abdominal squeeze down. Woo! Shoulders back, chest up. Belly button squeezed in towards your spine. Punches the shoulder height. Keep them strong. Four, three, double punch. Let's go. One, two, one, two, one, two. Ho! One, two, one, two, two. Ho! One, two, one, two. Two, ho! One, two, one, two. Last time. Skip for a march. Let's go. So higher option is a skip. Lower option is march. Shoulders, back, chest up. If you need to drink at any point, please do so. Next move, double side step. Step together, step, flick or tap. Woo! Single side step. Step, step. Four more. Then back to doubles. Two. One. Double side step. Step together, step. Tap and flick. One more. And step or march. Step or march. Next move is the heel decks. Whip or without the bounce. Cross and curl the arms. In four, three, two, heel digs. This is your higher option with the bounce. Lower option down here. No bounce. Next move. Knee lift, arm curl. Three, two, one, let's go. Woo! Lower option. No bounce. Jog, skip for a march. Next move that we're going to do. Arms come up, out, in, up, in, out, in, up, in, out. Forwards and back. Out, in, up, down, back. Forwards. And back. On the spot. Jog, skip for a march. Next move will be heel digs. We'll cross the arms, we'll lift them up high. In four, three, two, heel digs. Cross, up. Floor option, down here, no bounce. 
Next move, knee lift arm curls. Last one, knee lift arm curls. Woo! Again, lower option. No bounce. Next move, jumping jacks. Lower option, down here. You do what's best for you. Full foot on the ground. Keep on going, out and in. After this, single crunches forwards. Two more, let's go. Woo! Abdominal squeeze down. Shoulders back, chest up. Are you ready? Double punches go. One, two, one, two, one, two, ho. One, two, two, one, two, ho. One, two, one, two, ho. Job, skip or march. Are you ready to get those arms moving again? So it's going to be the same. We're going to go out, in, up, down. Forwards and backwards, go. Out, in, up, down, out, up, down and back. And again, out, in, up, down. This time just normal back. And again, up, down, out, in, up, down, out, in, normal back. And again, up, down, out, in, normal back. Tap and reach. Bend those knees. Woo! Lower option down here. Abdominal squeeze down. Jump, skip or march. Let's keep jogging, skipping or marching. Next move, pendulum swing. Lower option is this. Three, two, one, let's go. One, two, one, two. So your arms can do whatever you want while your pendulum swinging. You can have them here. You can have them side to side. It's entirely up to you. Lower option, no bounce. Tap side to side. Next move, heel digs. Crossing up with the arms. Cross up. Again, lower option. Down here, no bounce. Double side step. Step together, step. Tap or flex the leg. Woo! Single side step, arms up and down, lower option, out and in. Next move, heel decks, arms up and down. Four, three, Jog, skip or march. We're coming up to the end of the aerobic session. After this, it's toning. Double side step. Arms up and down or in and out. Flicking or tapping the leg. Single punches forwards. Woo! Abdominal squeezed in. Shoulders back, chest up. Are you punching as hard as you can? Double punch. One, two, one, two. Ho! One, two, one, two. Ho! One, two, one, two. Ho! Jog, skip for march. Think someone's saying hi to me. Hi. 
So it's going to be arms up, down, in and out. Three, two, one, let's go. Out, in, up, down. We're going to go forwards and back. Let's go. Out, in, up, down and again. And back. And again. Up, down, out, in. And back. Jumping jacks, let's go. Lower option. Higher option, jumping jack. Next move is box step. And four, three, box step, let's go. Down, out. So you'll notice the music's changed. March those legs. We're ignoring the man just now. So if you have a yoga mat or a towel or you want to use a rug, get that. Keep your legs moving. Keep them nice and warm. If you need to grab a mat, please do so. If you need a drink, please get one. So this part is toning up. If you have hand weights, Grab them as well. So I have some hand weights, not too heavy. We are going to work everything. As you'll have heard from me in music, it's counting down. So we're not doing each exercise for too long. Drink, grab a drink. Have your mat, your rug, your towel ready. We are beginning by standing. If you've got weights, grab them. Stand with your feet hip width apart, knees slightly bent, shoulders back, chest up, abdominals squeezed in, arms come up and down. So it's up and down. So if anybody is thinking, I can see okay just now, but if she lies down, I won't be able to see because of the comments. You can go up to your phone, your tablet, or whatever it is that you've got it on, swipe the comments to the right, and it'll disappear. Your screen will be clear again. So this time, we're going shoulder to waist. Up, down, up, down. We're working the biceps. Up, down, up, down. Keep on going. Can you feel it working? Keep on going, almost done. You do get a break. Keep on going. After this, we work our triceps. Almost done with this one. After this one, it's hip to waist, then it's triceps. Shake off those shoulders. Keep the same stance, abdominal squeeze in, bum squeeze in, shoulders back, chest up, next move. From your hips to your waist. So it should be an L shape. Let's go. Up, down, up, down. After this, it's triceps. Some of you call them bingo wings. That's what we're trying to avoid. Trying to tone them up. Keep your abdominals squeezed in, bum squeezed in, shoulders back, chest up. Keep on going.
less than half to go. Can you feel it burning? So if you don't have weights in the house, maybe you've got bottles of water. Two, one. Next move. See that arm up and back, but if you find that uncomfortable on your shoulders, the other option is the arm goes back here and up, back and up. We both work the tricep muscle. Let's go. Down, up, down, up. Keep your elbow close to your head if it's up here. If your arm's down here, make sure you're keeping control of the weight when you bring it back. Keeping your arm close to your body. Keep on going. If you want to make it harder, you can do both arms with both your weights. If you don't want to do that, you don't need to. Make sure your feet are hip width apart unless you have a sense of back. If you've got a sense of back, one foot goes behind. Two, one. So we're changing to the other arm. First half, just a single arm. Second half, both arms together. Remember, this is your other option if you find it hard or uncomfortable putting your hand up over your head. Down, up. Keeping the elbows close to your head as you can. Keeping abdominals squeezed in, bum squeezed in. Shoulders back, chest up. So we're working a bit of everything. We've done the cardio part. Other arm goes up, down and up. So if you were doing it another way, the only difference is both arms together. You can bring them up to here or you can do the bicep curl as well. That's up to you. Both elbows close to your head. Two, one. Next move. We're going to work our waist. We're going to skip the break. If you need a quick drink, grab a quick drink. Actually, I can't skip the break. So it's either one arm, sorry, both weights and one arm, or one weight or no weight, your feet are together. Shoulders are back, chest up, abdominals squeezed in, bum squeezed in, arm goes to the side, you're going down and up. So we're working our obliques, or the love handles. Two, one, down, up. So you're doing this at a speed that's good for you. Keep on going. Think of that nice toned waist. Down, up. Sometimes we do this move lying on the ground. I like to call it the penguin. Keep on going. Almost done. Two, one. Change sides. Shoulders back, chest up, hands by your side. Abdominal squeezed in, bum squeezed in. Again, keeping the arm close to the body. Just reaching as far down as you can with your legs nice and straight. Keep on going. Three, two, one. This time, feet hip width apart. 
We're going to lift up our arms, so they're in line with our shoulders. We're going out and in, so this is called your pec deck arms. We're working across the chest, toning up, out, in, out, in. So we're toning up the chest muscles, so keeping everything nice and tight. We're working back with our shoulders as well. Please ensure that your elbows are in line with your shoulders. If you've got a sense of back, one foot goes behind. Keep your core nice and tight, belly button squeezed in towards your spine, less than halfway to go. Keep on going. Abdominal squeezed in. Two, one. Rotate the shoulders. Next move that we're doing. Feet are outward facing. We are going to squat down. So it's a sumo squat down. Shoulders back, chest up. Arms come up. Lifting up the elbows as high as you can. So it's down and up. You can do this as fast or as slow as you like. We're working the legs as well as the arms the chest, the shoulders, and you'll possibly find that it's working your abdominals as well. Keep on going. Less than half to go. Keep on going. Squeeze in those abdominals, lift up those arms, pull up those elbows nice and high. Next move. Actually no, we're going to keep the weights. Feet forward facing. We're going to squat down, push up with the arms. Squat down, shoulders back, chest up, abdominals squeezed in. Keep on going. Less than half to go. That's it. Almost done. Squeeze in those abdominals. Still work deep if you don't have weights. One. We're getting rid of our weights. This time, we're squatting down, stepping back, squat, back. So it's a backwards lunge. You're staying as low as it's comfortable for you. You're using your arms to help with your balance. This is a leg burner. It's working your bum as well. Keep on going. Almost done. Can you feel it? Two, one. Shake off those legs. Quick drink. We'll keep our mat further back for now. Next move that we're going to do, oh, I'm stuck in here. We are going to squat down, not too far. We're going to step out, step in. Feet are forward facing. Shoulders back, chest up, abdominal squeezing. Step one side, then the other. Out, in, out, in. You're staying as low as it's comfortable for you. 
easier option. Higher you are, easier it is. The lower you are, the harder it is. We're working the inner thigh, we're working the front of them. We're working our bums. Squeeze in your abdominals. Out, in. Keep on going. Almost there. Three, two, one. Shake off the legs. Next move. Backwards lunge. Stepping back, in, back. As low as you like, higher up you are, easier it is. Lower down you are, harder it is. Let's go. Make sure your knees are not going over your toes. Use the arms, they help you balance. Stepping back as far as it's comfortable for you. Keep on going. Keep on going. Again, we're working the legs, you feel it burning down the front of the thighs. Easier option, higher. Harder option, lower. Keep your abdominals squeezed in. Three, two, one. Shake off the legs. Next move, planks. We're grabbing our mats, our rubber towel. If you need to, you can pop your knees on the mat. Hands or elbows in line with the shoulders. Abdominal squeezed in, bum squeezed in. Make sure your bum is lower than your shoulders. Keep your core nice and tight and your body weight should be forward. If you need to pop your knees down, you can do that, that's okay. Keep that core nice and tight. You can come down, shake off those arms, rotate those shoulders. And we'll do it again. So the further apart your feet are, the easier it is, the closer they are together, the harder it is. Keep your belly button squeezed in towards your spine. Pelvis curls under. So we're going to do another plank, but this time we're going to step out, in, out, in. Harder option, we jump it. So it's out and in, or tap, tap. Easier option. One knee on the ground. Thanks, Angela. Abdominal squeezed in. Again, remember your easier option, or if you need to, one knee on the ground. If you've got weak rest, you do it on your forearm, stepping out to them, or just a normal plank. Almost done. Two, one. Come down. Next one. Standard plank. When he says halfway there, you need to take a quick break, take one, come back up into the plank again. So it's hands or elbows in line with the shoulders. Pelvis curled under. Belly button squeezed in towards your spine. If you need to pop your knees down, you can do so. The further apart your feet are, the easier it is. Almost there. Quick break if you need one. Or you can change your position. Keep your elbows in line with the shoulders, or hands in line with the shoulders. Abdominals squeeze in, bum squeeze in. Keep that core nice and tight. Bum is lower than your shoulders. Two, one. We are sticking with our hands and knees. By this time, if you've got weak wrists, come down onto your forearms. Donkey kicks, we're working that bum. 
Bend that knee. Wake that foot. Up. Down. Up. Down. So by flexing your foot, I mean pointing your knee, sorry, your toes towards your knees. Look down towards the mat or the ground. I always find by flexing my feet doing donkey kicks, it stretches my calf, my hamstring, and in turn, that stretches your bum. It works it a wee bit harder. So you're just lifting up that leg as far as it's comfortable for you. Keep on going. Three, two, one. You need to stretch out your hips, drive your bum down towards your heels. Stretch out those arms. So round three is complete. We've only got one more round left. You need to remember what leg you've just worked for your bum. If you need a quick drink, grab it. We're going to do donkey kicks on the other side and then we're going to lie on our backs, work our abdominals. So it's hands or elbows in line with the shoulders. Abdominals squeezed in, back is nice and flat. Flex your foot. Let's point those toes towards your knees. Four, three, two, donkey kicks. Can't have one nice toe in front of cheek. And the other one is okay. You've got to work on both. Whatever you do to one side of your body, you need to try and do it again to the other. Keep on going. Lifting up that leg as far as it's comfortable for you. Working your bum. Might find this working your legs as well. Keep your abdominals squeezed in. After this, it's abs. One. So we're coming onto our backs. Knees are bent, feet flat on mat, abdominals squeezed in, fingers on temples. We're going to crunch up, breathing out and down. Eyes towards your knees. Elbows as wide as it's comfortable for you. Make sure you're not pulling on your head and your neck. If you need to, can pop your hands on your legs, tapping your knee and going down. Keep on going. Keep breathing. Out as you go up. In as you come down, abdominals squeezed in, back in nice and flat. Almost done. Three, two, one. Quick stretch out. Point fingers, point the toes at any point. If you need to stretch, please do this. Next move that we're going to do, we're going to go up for two, down for two. Up, up, down, down, up, up, down. Again with your hands, you can have them on your legs. Going up, up, down, down. Up, up, down, down. So it's just slowing down that move. I find sometimes that the slower moves seem to be more effective. Up. Up, down, down. Keep on going. Ice towards your knees. Two, one. Quick stretch out. Next move. Opposite arm, opposite leg crunching. Your other arm goes out wide. And you can either lift up or down, or you can support your head and neck. If you do have a weak neck or back, you might want to keep them flat on the ground, lifting and lowering your arm and your leg. We're sticking with the same arm, the same leg, 
reaching as high up as you can, trying to get that shoulder off of the ground. You can support your head and neck if you want to with your arm, but make sure you're not pulling on your head and neck. It's your arm is simply behind your head to support it. We're working across the abdominals, up around the lower. Keep on going. Three, two, one. Quick stretch. Then it's the other side. So again, your arm that isn't working is either out wide or it's behind your head and neck supporting it. Other arm out straight. Abdominals squeezed in. Crunch. Crunch. Breathing out as you crunch up. In as you go down. Squeezing in those abdominals. Halfway there, keep on going. Almost done. Then we've got one more exercise after this. Two, one. Quick stretch out. Final exercise that we do before we stretch off. Bicycle crunches, fingers on temples, easier option. One foot stays on the ground as you crunch. Harder option, no feet on the ground. The higher up your legs are towards the roof, the easier it is, the lower down towards the ground that they are, the harder it is. You're just going at speed that's good for you. We're working the lower abdominals, we're working across them. If your head, neck and shoulders are up, you're working your upper as well. Remember your easier option, one foot on the ground. Keep on going. Almost done. Two, one, stretch out. We're stretching our abdominals, we're pointing our fingers, pointing our toes, and then we're slowly going to come up. So, sitting up, we will bring our feet together. Try and push your knees towards the ground without physically pushing down on them. You're just trying to stretch them out as much as you can, stretching off the inner thighs. We'll slowly stand up. So, we have worked. Absolutely everything in this workout. Drive your heel to the ground, towards the sky. Bend that back leg, lean on the bent leg. If you would like a deeper calf stretch, reach down towards your toes. So we've worked everything from our fingers to our toes. Change leg. If you fancy doing this workout again, you can do so. It will be on the Ledger Active Facebook page for a while. Stand with your feet as wide as it's comfortable for you. Lean into one leg. Just need to stretch that one a bit further. You'll feel a stretch in your inner thigh. Make sure the other foot is forward facing. So both of them are facing forwards. Leaning into one leg. And then the other leg stretching off the inner thigh on the other one. If you can do so, Try and reach the ground with your hands. If you can't, you can hang on to your legs. So we're stretching the inner thigh and the back of the hamstrings. So we come up, rotate those shoulders round. Deep breath in, reach up. Feet together, leaning to one side, stretching off your obliques. Into the middle, other side. Clasp your hands behind your back, feet hip width apart. Shoulder blades together, pushing out your chest. Clasp your hands in front, elbows nice and wide, pushing out your back. We'll do a quadricep stretch. If you need to hang onto the wall, a chair, someone in your house, grab them. Feet together, sorry, knees together, stretching down the front of your thigh, shoulders back, chest up, shoulder blades together. 
Your other hand can be wherever it's comfortable for you. Change legs. So hips forward, knees together, shoulders back, chest up. Shake off your legs, feet hip width apart. Deep breath and reach up. We're going to squat down, breathing out. Deep breath and reach up. Squat down. We'll do it one more time. And that's us done. Thank you very much. Hope you enjoyed that and I will hopefully see you soon. Bye.